Right, I guess we'll go to Defense to Dark Arts class. The map is enchanted to help you find your way. This will be incredibly helpful. <coughs> Thank you. Now, sounds like you've quite a day ahead, what with classes and a trip to Hogsmeade for supplies, including your own wand. You'll enjoy Mr. Ollivander. He's an exceptional craftsman and a good friend. I shall reach out when I have more information about our mysterious locket. For now, focus on your classes and pay attention. More than your owls may hinge on the magic you are able to master within these walls. Okay. Well, see you later, Fig. I don't want to be late. Move! Here I go. Got. Uh, oh, Professor Hackett! Perhaps you'd be good enough to blast each other to pieces on your own time. I get new students every year, but I only have one Hebridean black skull. It was a token from the great poacher raid of 1878. No doubt you've heard of it. Now, you may be asking yourself how an old woman like me single-handedly took out the largest poacher ring in eastern Wales and lived to boast about it. Knowledge. To the wise, age matters very little. Today we will review a spell that has saved me from death at the hands of dark wizards more times than I care to remember. Levioso. Levioso. A levitation charm? Levioso! A surprised opponent is a weak opponent. Care to defend yourself, Master Pruitt? No? One thing I've learned as an unspeakable is the value of simplicity, especially in the heat of battle. Now, let's practice what we've just learned, starting with something small. Okay. Okay, so right up and then okay. right up. Yep, yep, yep. Boom. Levioso. Levioso. Perfect. Now, let's try something a little larger. Okay. Let's begin for that? with a basic cast. See how the dummy deflected your cast. This time, cast Levioso first, then the basic cast. Okay. Remember, a surprised opponent is a weak opponent, as Master Pruitt so artfully helped me demonstrate earlier. Got it. Levioso. Good. Now, well done. Good, but the best way to practice is by dueling. We'll start with you two. Duelist, take your marks. So I feel right. proper Hogwarts welcome. Now, <laughs> I want a fair duel using only Levioso, basic cast, and Protego. You may begin. Levioso, Protego. Lucky. Nothing lucky about it. Shit. I'm beating your ass, Sebastian. Not bad for a beginner. You give as good as you get. <coughs> <laughs> I don't think he's happy. Look at me a smile, like, yes. I put you on the spot, and you rose to the challenge. Points to Slytherin. Thank you, Professor Hackett. Glad to have the opportunity to practice. If what I've seen today is any indication, we can expect great things from you. I demand excellence from my students. They are capable of achieving it, and they must achieve it. 
A classroom duel is one thing, but battling dark wizards, or as ever more likely, goblins, is a different kettle of Grindelows entirely. Understood, Professor. So, I'd advise you to keep practicing whenever you can. Perhaps Mr. Sallow will have some ideas for you. Again, well done today. I shall reach out soon with additional assignments. Awesome. Oh, I don't know, I probably should talk to you, huh? I enjoyed that. Well, that duel was quite something. Everyone will be talking about it. It was certainly good practice. Practice? Felt more like I was dueling an expert. Didn't expect a new student to be so deft with a wand. Then again, perhaps this wasn't your first duel. Um... Uh... In yep. fact, it was. Perhaps I have a knack for it. Be coy if you like, but I know better. Magic requires intention and talent. You know, you might be a perfect fit for a certain exclusive, unsanctioned dueling organization. Oh. Exclusive and unsanctioned. <clears throat> Count me in. Excellent. Knew I was right about you. If you want to get the most out of your time at Hogwarts, you're going to need to break the rules now and then. Whether it's joining a secret dueling club or sneaking into the restricted section of the library, you just have to be clever enough not to get caught. Thank you, Sebastian. I'll keep that in mind. Good. Pleasure chatting with you. I'm sure I'll see you soon. Perhaps somewhere <clears throat> unsanctioned? We'll see if your performance today was sheer luck or actual skill. Look for Luke and Brattleby near the clock tower entrance. If you're interested. Okay. Charm class. Okay, so I'm assuming. Uh, okay, so I, I'm assuming like the like the gold one here, or oh no. Okay, so it's by icons. Okay, so the icon here is um <laughs> is a story mission, and then this is a side quest. Uh, I'm sure. Okay. Professor okay. Ronan. Hello. <coughs> here, behind you, there is an open seat here. Thank you. Hello, I am Nettie. So you are the new student. Have you met Professor Ronan yet? <coughs> Shall we begin? <laughs> Welcome to year five of Charms. Now, this will be a crucial year in your education on the art of charm work, but I am confident that we will take hold with a passion and rigor requisite of such a challenge. Right, now, everyone, please <coughs> open your textbooks to page 517. But before we begin, can anyone here tell me the difference between the incantations of the color change and growth charms? Anyone? Anyone? Oh. Hmm? Ah, 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 ah. I am afraid it is too late to study now. Hmm. My, the summer months must have really taken a toll on you all. <laughs> By the looks of it, you all spent your holidays practicing obliviate on one another. <laughs> uh, hmm. Do you even remember how to perform a basic summoning charm? Well, it seems that we are in dire need of review. Everyone get into pairs and take positions on opposite sides of the classroom. Now let's put those textbooks to use as the blunt objects you so believe they are and take turns summoning them out of one another's hands. Only one book will be needed per partnership, Miss Dale. Thank you. Get into place now. I like this, this professor, he's fun. All right, for Accio. Accio. That is not bad. You are a swift learner. I see a lot of potential, but remember, 
Potential is nothing without practice. Keep at it. You might just rival Miss Onai here. Very good, everyone. That's enough of that. Well, as you all seem to have the basics down and it is an exceptionally lovely day, I was thinking that we might have ourselves a little excursion outside for a spot of fresh air. After me. Hmm. What does he have planned? <coughs> ah. <coughs> Sorry. I've always found that fun goes hand in hand with mastery, as I'm sure the Quidditch players amongst us would agree. Hmm? <laughs> so, what better than a bit of sport to put our prowess with the summoning charm to the test, right? <laughs> 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 so why don't we have our newest students start us off? Hmm? Eh? Oh, of course. <laughs> All right. Very simply, cast Accio on one of the spheres and relinquish your charm at the last possible moment. Now, uh, think of this like gobstones, if you will. But instead of throwing the marbles out, you are summoning them toward you. Akio, okay. the trick is to pull this. Splendid! Don't Shit. lose your composure. Okay, hold on. I got this. That's it. Oh, stop! Not too Hey, okay, hold on. I got this. I got this. I got this. I got this. Stop. Excellent control there. Yes. God damn, what the fuck? Very good! Points to Slytherin! But there's certainly no sport <coughs> in playing without some friendly competition. Miss Onai, would you care to give our new student a bit of a challenge? Come on up! Right. You be the blues, just as before, and Miss Onai, you are playing red. Clear? Yes, sir. Okay. What's this? Yes! All right. Akio. Stop it, stop it, stop it. Thank you. Very good. This Just going for 30s now, are we? Well, I'm going for 50s here. Because I'm just better than you. Okay, stop, 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 stop. Quite impressive. Oh my god. Oh. Okay. Alright. That is how it's done. I swear to God, if you freaking knocked a- Okay, okay, hold on, I, I got this, I got this. Akio! Uh, yeah, perfect! A perfect score! Remarkable! Yeah, fuck you, bitch! I'm better than you! What you got to say for that, huh? Huh? <coughs> Let us make this a bit more interesting, shall we? A bit more interesting. What the fuck? <laughs> oh. I think we are well past interesting at this point. Okay. I'll say. Enough chatter. Focus now. You will need it. This round settles it all. Here we go. <coughs> there we go. Okay. Now. Yeah. Yeah, you know, that's fine. We're good. Lisa. Yes. She got another thirty. What the fuck? Okay. All right. All right. All right. It's fine.
All right, and I will have another 30. Out! Well played. We could, we could tie this up. Let us do this. <clears throat> that is how it's done. Okay. And... Now. Stop it. Stop it. Yes. Aha. Well done. I'm just better. I'm just better. Very good, both of you. Well done. Class is dismissed. Gather your things on the way out. Good game back there. I must admit, I think I underestimated you. Took me weeks to become proficient with Akio. Took weeks for me to get anything right when I transferred here. It gets easier, I promise. Hmm. I'm glad you That's understand. good to hear. It's a lot to take in all at once. To put it lightly, I remember how I felt when I first arrived. I transferred here from Wagadu just before my fourth year. My mother received an offer to teach divination here. Before I knew it, we had left Uganda and were halfway around the world at a new school in a new country. It's nice to learn about another wizarding school. Thank you for asking. I do miss Wagadu, but I am glad to be here at Hogwarts. Ah, I think Professor Ronan wants to talk to you. Better not keep him waiting. Until mm. next time. Yes, until next time. Of course, you can use a word if you would. You wanted to speak with me, fun. Professor. I did. I trust your first charms lesson lived up to expectation? Well, an outdoor competition wasn't exactly the lesson I was expecting, sir. What charm is there in the expected? You did well, managing to best as gifted a student as Miss Onai. Thank you, Professor. I enjoyed the match. Miss Onai is always a fierce competitor, though I sense that she is a bit distracted of late. <clears throat> now, Professor Weasley has asked that your professors give you instruction outside of the ordinary curriculum. Expect okay. to hear from me soon regarding a special assignment that I am preparing for you. Cool. Quest complete. Let's go. Hello there. You're the new student, aren't you? Do I dare to talk to you right now? I don't know. It was Hephaestus Gore. It I can't! And it wasn't Flack, but you're all in trouble with Professor Black! Oh, hi! <laughs> oh, you're so cute. Side quests are now available. Available side quests can be found in, uh, inside regions of Hogwarts marked as flags and discovered by exploring the world. These quests are an XP, but do not advance the main story. Awesome, okay. So what is this then? Weasley after class. Okay, we can, we can go ahead and um, complete the first day. And then, uh, and then after that we can go ahead and, well, I'm probably gonna uh, stream the side quest stuff. Hello. What about the room, Professor? <clears throat> I was thinking the same thing, Deke. Perhaps you could help. Oh, uh, excuse, Deke. <laughs> ah, there you are. I trust your first classes went well? They did, Professor. I heard as much from Professors Hecate and Ronan. Seems Professor Fig taught you quite a bit during your brief detour near... What was it you said? Some ruins? I'd wager there's a good deal more to your travels here than what you've told me. Isn't there? Um... Nope. Nothing more, Professor. I see. <clears throat> like trying to get a sonnet from a streeler. Regardless, you must continue to build upon what you've learned. In that regard, I've asked your professors to help hasten your progress with some extra assignments. Um, yeah. Professor Ronan did mention something about that. 
In fact, Professor Ronan will meet you outside momentarily to assign your first one. Now, regarding the trip to Hogsmeade I mentioned earlier, we've arranged to replace the supplies lost on your way here, including seeds, potion recipes, and spell crafts. Thank you, Professor. And Mr. Ollivander will connect you with the perfect wand. Let's go! You managed your classes well with a borrowed wand, but you'll find the magic you cast with your own wand to be far superior. Okay. I'm eager to get to Hogsmeade. Very well. I'd like you to make <coughs> your first visit to the village with a classmate. Help you get your bearings. Perhaps Sebastian Sallow or Natsai Onai. I've noticed you spending time with them. Sebastian's cool, and I also like Natty. Oh, man. I think I'll go with I'd like uh, to Sebastian. go with Sebastian. Glad to hear it. Mr. Sallow is a capable young wizard, and he knows the area. He'll keep you well clear of any of Victor Rookwood's undesirables en route. Rookwood? A rather unsavory local. Best to avoid him and his associates, including his right hand of sorts, Theophilus Harlow, if you can. Once you've finished Professor Ronan's assignment, your friend will meet you at the castle doors. No time to waste. The sooner you complete your work, the sooner you can enjoy a butterbeer at the Three Broomsticks. Okay then. <laughs>